Welcome to the Group Chat Chronicles. I'm your host, Dev. With me this episode, I have Leek. What's up, Leek? Yo, what's up, good people? And today we have a guest entering the chat. We have the host of the 280 Plus podcast, Los. What's up, Los? What's up, man? It's about time, bro. <laughs> it's about time, man. I've been wanting to get on this show, man. You know what I mean? All right. And on this podcast, we always uh, give our own takes on a lot of topics. And as always, I want to thank everybody for listening. So before we start the podcast, well, we, we always go over what we have been tuned into, whether it be music, movies, books, TV shows, other podcasts, or whatever. So, Leek, what have you been tuned into as a league? I ain't been tuned into shit, bro. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> like, I literally, like, <laughs> playlist-wise, like, Spotify, they got the best playlist selection, I swear. <laughs> but um, I just been playing, like, 2000s, just, like, whatever they had on the 2000s on Shuffle. All right. So what? DMX, fucking mm-hmm. Ludacris. Okay. Um, who else they got heavy on that? Red Man. Oh. Um, he got Red Man heavy on my shit. So yeah, if you yeah. want me to say that, yeah. Right. Other than that, that's it. Alright, that lowest way you've been tuned into as a um a little bit of everything, man. Um, you know, I, I got the I got a second podcast, man. Uh, recap and record. So we uh focusing on House of the Dragon. So every week we we come with that. Atlanta, the new season of Atlanta is fire. Like every like like every, every, they back, they back. Have you tuned in? Yet? I just I was listening to the, your last episode, uh-huh. and you was you was like nah, and, and you know I felt the same way about yeah. season three, yeah. but season right. four they getting back to the essence, bro. Like right. it's it's all you know the same. You know what I mean, and then like it, it reminded me of like a, sec, a season two. You know right. what I'm saying? Right. And then battle rap, all that. Like music wise, uh, that new Ari Lennox, I just tapped into that. Uh, my man Jay okay. Latell was saying that's the album of the year. I disagree, okay. but but it's still good. It's a good vibe. Okay. It's a good vibe. Um, me, nothing. Same old, same old for real. I mean, other than my Aces winning the championship. Other than that, <laughs> that's a, you, know, you, you really watched the WNBA? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Why? Why? I like basketball. Oh. <laughs> if you like basketball, I don't know if you'd watch the WBA. No, I mean, no offense. No, I, mean, I, like, I, like, I, like, I don't know. If that's I don't know. If that's like you know. I would rather watch your car than watch. That's crazy. I, you, I mean, is that what about the uh, Vegas Stallion T-shirt? What? what? <laughs> oh, we did. My bad. Disclaimer. Would you wear one? What what sir? No, 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 because I gotta make teaching. Oh, not probably not. Nah, I'm not wearing. I'm probably not wearing. Slightly sleep, my bad. I'm playing the game a little bit. No, maybe, like, maybe if she's like, you know, obviously like exposing herself or something like that, like just on some games and shit, like you know, like oh yo, got a, got a big booty joint on my t-shirt. Yeah. But like, but nah, not on some like I'm a Meg fan. <laughs> Like, nah, I mean, like, I like Meg too. Like, I'm not a Meg fan, though. So, yeah, so that's right. That's where it's yeah, like, right. That's a separation there, you know what I mean? Yeah. Even, I like Beyonce, but I'm not wearing Queen Bee, like, I'm not wearing Ivy Park or nothing like that, you know what I mean? Yeah. I need some right now. <laughs> oh, oh, but yeah, man. like, I might, I might have to tune back into Atlanta, but. I don't know. It's fire. I'm a binger, so I'm definitely going to watch it when like, the season like almost over. Yeah. That's when I tap in and just go in. Yeah. So, um, first topic. Uh, Char- Charlemagne, the guy, said, I think, I, I know he said this on Brilliant Idiots like a few weeks ago. I don't know why. It's, it's starting to get traction now. He must have said it, said it like recently on The Breakfast Club, I guess. But I know he said it on the Brilliant Idiots. He said that um, Chief Keith isn't globally influential so mm. how do you feel about i feel like he's right but he's wrong so like i feel like the person that more or less would get the credit is dirt mm. but like if you ask me it really wouldn't be no dirt like that if it wasn't the chief key because that's how i found out about dirt yeah. and i'm not that much in the drill so i know if that's how i found out that's how probably how majority of the people found yeah, out yeah, yeah. so but, like, he's definitely in, I would say, like, black culture, okay. influential, okay. for sure, without a shadow of a doubt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but globally, again, globally, he he might be right on that. Okay. But I think Dirk getting all that, for sure. Okay. And he's putting on hard, so shout out to him. All right. All right. What about you, Lou? 
Um, I ain't gonna hold you. I'm not really versed in drill music, whatever. But like, I gotta kind of go off of what the people that listen to drill and and they they tout. You know what I mean, Chief Keith and his influence. So like, I'm gonna just kind of go with what they saying. But in terms of global influence, I don't know. It, I guess Drill was in like the UK and stuff like that, whatever. Yeah, so yeah, I, I guess so. Yeah, so technically he would. Yeah, you know I mean, like I guess he would have a global influence, but I don't know. Charlemagne sometimes his takes on. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I might be a little biased with my take because I mean I graduated high school in 2014 and like talk about it. Damn, if you would, this shit. Man. <laughs> <laughs> I graduated in '06, my nigga. Like, <laughs> Damn, like so yeah, like drill missed me, bro. Like like that was like we was already into other shit, but yeah. like so I might be a little biased, but like I just think like you you couldn't walk through your college hallways without somebody listening to some drill type of music. That's a fact. Mm-hmm. So it was like and then like and then like you had people people on Facebook making their names Sosa, Glow Game, mm-hmm. Almighty, something. Yeah. You, you you and you still got people calling their enemies obs. Yeah. You got. You got uh, when when like your sports team wins a game, you say you're you're smoking on whoever's pad. Well, yeah. So it's yeah. like, okay. Okay. and then and, and then you got the Dirks, the Herbs, the Fabios, the Pop Smokes, the Ice Spice, the UK drill scene. So yeah, I would say he's globally influential. I, Ice, Spice, Ice Spice is drill. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Actually, I gotta yeah. tap in now. Like I don't know now. Like she just she be talking. I thought she just be talking about. I mean, I mean, is she all right? Is she all right? No, I mean, I'm gonna say, is she like a five year or a pop smoke? Nah, but she raps on drill beats. Okay, but I mean, so I, I consider her to be drill. Okay, yeah. So yeah, I, so yeah, I I disagree with Charlamagne actually. But yeah. do you think his name, like when you when you say drill, his name sticks to everybody globally? Yes. Yeah, Chief Keef? Yeah, yes. yeah, I think so. I don't know. So. Maybe I'm out of touch. I feel like Dirk would get that like, nah. if you talk to more or less like again the outsider of black culture. I feel like they gonna say Dirk. I don't know because cause, cause they don't know Chief Keef. No, nah, because I, I know. I mean, I might be a little biased with this, but I know some white kids that went to these suburban schools listening to Chief Keef. So oh, it was like God. so. It's so but like, that's our era, though. I'm talking like now. It's now, a little different. They out of touch. Like even DJ Academics talking crazy. Like, oh, no. <laughs> what, what you say? Oh, right. that the uh, old rappers are, are like dusty. And, uh, uh, like okay. nigga, this man got Russell Simmons talking. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wow. LL Cool J. Oh yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. 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 LL, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's pretty oh, bad. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't understand. Like, I, I like. I, I'm, I'm not gonna say I like academics, but like. He's like hot and cold. Like he might be like I might agree with him sometimes, but when he but when he's off, he's all the way off. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. It's just I guess my question is, was he drunk? What he said? Because sometimes he be on his stream, and you know when he's streaming, it was drunk. What he do is like regular video. Chicken it like a did it that joint? That's yeah. more professional. Okay. More. Yeah. He's more focused, organized. Yeah. But that stream, he's raw. Yeah. He's drunk as shit. Yeah. Like. I'm surprised nobody ever like got at him. I mean, because you know when he used to really cover the drill scene, he used to it used to get messy, man. Yeah, like, right. you know what I mean, like really highlighting it and exploiting it and mm-hmm. and like, you know, everybody felt like, yo, he not really he not really about that. Like he not really in the streets. So like yeah. why but again, I I don't want nothing bad to happen to no. Bro, oh, but, no, but like it's that. just it's just like he he talks a little bit too regular sometimes where you surprised like yeah. I mean even Charlemagne got punched up on I mean before yeah, you know yeah, what I'm yeah. saying? so like yeah. you know, so, right. so so Leek you don't agree with so you do agree with Charlemagne kind of I'm half and half <laughs> I'm half and half with it like yeah. I feel like black because black culture is globally. Yeah. But, like, I feel like, again, with you, because, like, if you ask me, like, Dirk is, like, out of here, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, if you ask those people that really don't know nothing about rap like that, about drill, I feel like they just going to say Dirk. They're not really going to know I mean, about Chief Keef like that. That's fair. Because I don't, I don't know how, but, like, I just did, like, late 2017, early 2018, Dirk became the Dirk we named. We know today. Right. So Out of like, nowhere. Like, I mean, I ain't going to lie. I kind of predicted it. In a way, I but, didn't. Um, I ain't gonna lie. For me, his I thought nah. Chief Keith was gonna be the, you know, the one. He was yeah, seventeen yeah. with the Interscope contract of any young boy's dream. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. I, dang, I, I don't mean, know. I, I mean, 
You can give it the dirt, but I, I don't know. Well, what, what happened to Chief Keef? Did he get like get locked up a bunch of times? Like, what? Like, how come his career didn't like ascend? Like, some I think of these it was other between dudes? that and that band okay. from the hometown for real. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. okay. Like, I think that kind of really messed him. Like, he can't even really even he... be around those guys type time. Yeah. Like, oh, okay. it's that bad. Yeah. Oh, okay. Like, yeah, it's pretty bad for my knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> So I, I would say that. And that's why I, I would say he's not necessarily globally. But again, black culture is global. So yeah, I don't know. Yeah. I, don't, I don't know. Like, I don't, I, I, I'm going to say, like, you might not know who Chief Keep is, but he he has his his footprints on, a, on yes. a lot of shit. So, yeah. For sure. He literally set the, he set the blueprint. Yeah. That's yeah. a fact. So uh, moving on. So... A few days ago, it was announced that Taylor Swift <laughs> will be performing at next year. Ain't last long. Huh? <laughs> next year is Super Bowl. We ain't open these great clothes in for us. No more so, we're walking at the Super Bowl. <laughs> so, how do y'all feel about that? I figured. <laughs> Overall, um, that's my answer to that. Um, I mean, I feel like, of course, it's going to happen again. At least I would hope so yeah. for, you know, rap. But, um, yeah, it, it, take, it takes time. <laughs> yeah. It takes time. Yeah, Rome yeah. wasn't built in a day, my mom would say. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to just go with that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you got to think, though, like, you know, in terms of the NFL's audience, man, like, it ain't it ain't us, man. We only, we only make up 30% of the country's population, right. even though the league is probably, like, 70% black, whatever. Yeah. Um, but the people that's watching, you know what I mean, like it, they do got to kind of cater to everybody. So like, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? They, 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 they give us, you know, the West coast, uh, Super Bowl show we had, you know, we had Travis Scott, we had the weekend on before. Um, it's, it, I think it's to be expected, man, that they're going to, they're going to, you know, try to balance it out, whatever, but I don't want to see, it don't need to be like fit, you know, however many times they do fit, you know, these, uh, Super Bowl shows, it don't need to be another like 30, 40 years before another yeah. black, black artist, like, Facts. you know, headlines it, but, yeah, so. It would be dope if they mixed it. Yeah. Like, do a yeah. Taylor Swift and, like, a little Baby. Oh. Mix that shit up. Shit, yeah, shit, I mean? shit, shit, Lil Baby at the Yo, World Cup Yo, hot NFL. That's not, that's not his reach at all. Oh, yeah? Yeah, he, he's performing at the World Cup. He's performing at the hard. World Cup. That's yeah. hard. Yo, and I felt holla at me. I could be one of the, you know what I mean? I'm going to fall on the wall. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I ain't mad at it. I mean, I personally don't want to see a test book and little baby show. <laughs> show. I mean, I, to me, to me, I want to see one or the other. But, oh, I mean, well, I, mean I don't want to see Taylor Swift. Let me, hold on. <laughs> like, like, he wants to see Taylor Swift. No, I don't. I don't want to see, I, hey, all right, all right. If I'm, if, if I'm watching the Super Bowl at the halftime show, I, I, I want to see Taylor Swift or Lil Baby. I don't want to see him come on. I feel like, I just feel like, I don't know. Just mix that shit up. I mean, I'm not yeah. mad at it, but like, it's, it is what it is. Like, I'm watching a game. So it's like, <laughs> so it's like, like, I like, I like exactly. football. I like football, so I'm already going to be watching it. I think, I think that like the halftime show is like more for the people, the, the like the casual fans, the people that really don't watch football. Mm-hmm. So to me, I don't care about the halftime show. Like, right. I'll watch it. And like I might pay attention more if it's like artists I like, like last mm-hmm. year's Super yeah. Bowl yeah. or the weekend or uh what was the year before? Was it like Shakira or somebody? Oh Shakira and Jay. Oh, that was actually yeah, that, that was, was fire. fire. That was yeah. fire. Cause they was on the yeah, they was doing them dancing more, <laughs> like woo, <yo>. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was yeah, yo. yeah, I remember that one. Like, I'll never forget that one. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I mean, then, like, before that, in terms of, like, black entertainment, did Janet? Or was that? It got to be somebody in between there. Yeah. Oh, Beyonce. Oh, yeah. Be- Beyonce. Yeah. 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 She, she yeah. shut the Super Bowl. Yeah. Oh, the the yeah. blackout. Yeah, I mean, she, blackout. she shut the whole fire down. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> then, like, Janet before that. Janet. Yeah. yeah. And then before that. What, Michael? Yeah. Did Michael do a Super Bowl? Yeah. yeah. Prince did yeah. one. Princeton. Oh, Princeton won during Princeton that time. Won? Yeah. Okay. I, don't, I mean, like I said, I'm already going to be watching the game. So, like, the Super Bowl halftime shows are relevant. So, yeah. Yeah. And I feel like every real fan of, of actual football feels like that, too, though. Yeah, I think the yeah. the halftime shows for ladies. I mean, right. Even that's, the commercials. That's what kind of draws like, them yeah. in a little yeah. bit. You know? Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, but them commercials are terrible, though. I ain't going to lie. 
They really, it's like, yo, y'all spent all this money to say nothing. <laughs> than what you would say in a regular commercial. Yeah, they definitely <laughs> fell off the commercials. Like. So, yeah, um, moving on. So, um, <laughs> <laughs> so uh, there is a TV show on FXX called Little Demon. Oh. And uh, mm. that was advertised <laughs> during a primetime college football game. And Leak had an issue with that. Uh, so, Leak, how do you... But what, what, what is that major issue on this? I just feel like it's kind of um, distasteful in a way, on a creator standpoint. Um, like I when I, I actually seen the ad, so I you know did my slight little research, yeah. and basically the premise of the show <clears throat> is mom had a baby with the devil. And exactly. <laughs> Off rip. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, and she was like, I guess going to a new school, starting a new school. She's like 13 or something, and kids were picking on her, and basically she broke out of demon mode. Oh. And her mom pulls up to the school because I guess mom sensed what was going on. Tight time is like, right, get fuck it, we gotta talk. So basically, you're a child of Satan. <laughs> yeah. And he basically comes back and tries to take her soul. And this is from the creators of Rick and Morty. Okay. So it's like, um, I get it, but I feel like that's a little too deep. Okay. You get what I'm saying? Um, well, all right. What network was this on? Like, was this FX. on? Well, not the show, but like the, the actual broadcast like was it on fs1 or was it on espn was it on abc because i think that kind of that's meant... abc right if you say it was a college game well, i mean, I mean they, they, they I covered it... college games on a lot of channels. i mean i forget it, it was during the lsu game and I... oh, so it might be espn yeah, i'm not even sure but not because I, I, I only i only said it because like if it was like on fs1 mm-hmm. well yeah that's the i mean that's a part of the channel you know what i mean like fox yeah. spring or whatever right. but yeah like I don't know. I guess where y'all going with? I wonder where y'all going with, like the influence and stuff like that. But, I mean, I'm not. I, I I get what Leek's saying, but like the same time, like the show come on at ten o'clock on like it, it it's it, it's not it's, it's not even on FX. It's on FX like so like their little sister channel or whatever. Okay. So it's like so it's like I get it, but at the same time, it's like I'm not mad at it. It's for adults. It's not. Like, I don't know. Like, I just feel like it's a little distasteful. I mean, that's all I would say. I like, like, maybe like Netflix. I could see that being like better, but like, primetime cable? Well, all right, even too, what time was the game? Like, if it, if it was like the 12 o'clock game on ABC or something like that, that'd be kind of wild. But nah, yeah, I it was that t- night. yeah, so I, I don't know. I think they, they don't even expect like, you know, kids to even be up even watching the game. So, like, yeah, they advertising it to like a adult demo. I don't know. But, they know big goddamn well kids be watching the goddamn game. I mean, yeah, but like, like little little kids, like they not paying attention to that. Yeah, is I mean, like, even like, 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 even, like, even, like, even if the game is on, they're they're playing with their toys, they own their tablets, they doing whatever. So Injuries, like, everything, man. I mean, I I get it, but at the same time, it's just like, uh, whatever. I'm not mad at know. it. I just felt like it should be a bit more on a more on a uh, exclusive okay situation. Like I said, Netflix, Hulu, maybe. I mean, I all right. So, all right. So, how, even so, though they still got access to that shit, I'm pretty sure that's yeah. where you about to go with it. But no, 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 it's no, just no, more no. of a. I don't know. Because my question is like, how were they supposed to advertise it then? Like to advertise everything else. Like I'm talking about, like I mean, I'm not even mad at like the advertisement per se. My thing is more or less the show itself. Oh, okay. okay. Like the advertise, like I know that was the the initial question too. Yeah. But like the advertise, like you gotta advertise how you advertise. Like yeah. I, I get that, but my thing is the initial show. That's yeah. kind okay. of my thing. Uh, but like, but like, what if you're like not into religion like that? Like that's what I mean. Of course, they're not going to. Exactly. <laughs> but like it is a lot of people that are. It's people that die behind that yeah, religion. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. for years. Like yeah. and I'm not even gonna go too deep into that, but we just gonna go off the facts on that in recent years. So I said it's a little I don't know. Well the fact that it's on FS FXX, it's probably not the most explicit, right? You know what I mean? Like I mean, they, uh, they don't uh, get too crazy, uh, right? Uh, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, 
Atlanta season yeah. two had nudity in it, so oh no, and that's they trying to be on star level, on yeah. stars level. Okay, they co- they trying to compete now. Okay. Yeah, that, you know yeah, I mean? yeah, like, yeah, it's like you know how like I guess uh from like the two thousands to like I say twenty fourteen, like it kinda like they got saying fuck a lot now. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. like you, you know what I mean? Yeah. That was getting to that, you know, like he's like he said in Atlanta, you want you might see a nipple. <laughs> nah, nah, it wasn't even a nipple, it was the episode where uh where uh they went to the college to before. <laughs> And they went to the fry house to smoke weed. Oh, yeah. Yeah, part, it was yeah. in the TLC. Like, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 Well, you might see that, too. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's the change up. We're competing yeah. out here. Yeah, like, yeah, 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 like, yeah, like, he, like, even BET getting a little <laughs> crazy. Like, they used to be, like, super sensitive now. It's just like, wow. Not for real? Yeah, for they, real? They, they, they be saying everything but fuck, bro. Oh wow! Damn near. Oh wow! Yeah. What yeah. show? What show are you watching on BET? It's everything. Oh, okay. It's oh anything. wow! Yeah, anything. I mean, I think, I think, I think if it's like baby, <laughs> baby boy, it's still edited like crazy. But like, <laughs> yeah. if it's but like, like if it's like, like an actual <laughs> show, they be they, they be saying whatever. Is that um Tyler Perry? His is it his shows or is, is it like I mean, somebody else? Maybe. <clears throat> oh, I, I, I used to watch Boomerang, the TV show, and they and they were doing that on there, so. That's that, that that that's right. You already got a TV show. I know that's, that's dope. They got a TV show. No, it lasted. It lasted two seasons. Okay. And like I think like Lena Wraith was uh, created it. Lena Wave. Yeah. Okay. Oh, shout out to Lena, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's 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 not like the shot at all, but <laughs> 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 nah, it's basically it's basically uh Eddie Murphy and um Ali Berry's kids and then oh like, we're gonna, we're gonna a couple. What? I mean, it was cool, but it wasn't. Okay. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie for overbearing. That was the yeah, shit. Yeah, oh man, had, had, had Drew, Drew from, from about Hates Chris was on um, Halle okay. Berry's son. Okay. Oh, okay. 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 Yeah, I haven't seen him since everybody. That show. I, yeah. I don't even think I rec- would recognize him. Yeah, he was in that, that Fifth House Party movie. What? Yo, this yeah. is crazy. You no. you chosen right now? <laughs> but that, 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 no, it's called House Party Five tonight. Tonight. I know that. Jesus, you know there is like seven Home Alones. Yeah, like there's like seven. Yeah, like yeah, yeah like, like, like you ever go on Disney right now? Like you could see all of them. Yeah, like I, I bad. They're bad. If a movie got like came out in the 80s or 90s, I. Can guarantee you got like four sequels. <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie. But now though, now because now because at the end of the house party movie, Kid and Play maybe it makes a cameo like at the very end, because Drew from Drew from Drew from about hates Chris and uh the white boy gets uh signed to them or something like that. Oh, okay. It's really you trash. know what? Well, I think I did see that shit. Like or BET like years ago. That yeah. sounds kind of familiar. Yeah, it was, it was terrible. Pretty much. <laughs> yeah. Like, like that actually sounds a little familiar. Uh, that's funny. Yeah. So, <laughs> moving on into uh, another topic. Pull this picture up. Oh, yeah, I'm prepared again. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, I got his name in my phone. This is. Alright. Alright, so the tweet said from <laughs> Come to. Come to London. My brother and his girl was together for seven years. She came home one day and told him, I'm attracted to a man at work. Oh, we haven't man. done anything, but I think I want to see where it goes with him. Thank, thank you for the wonderful years. <laughs> Nigga said he rather her cheated than told him that. So, Lee, how do you feel about that? I respect that she told him. Well, yeah, I yeah. feel like he dodged a bullet. For real, for real. Like, yeah, that shit might hurt. It's a little stinger, but... I mean, you know that that shit clearly crazy. She gave us seven years for a possibility. Not even saying that boy even wanted, but like you know, yeah, I, like you like you said, it's like I, I think he's cute. I just want to see where it might go. <laughs> see, but then I say that her current relationship bull probably was wasting her time a little bit. You know, what I'm saying yeah. so. Like, and I I think I've seen that kind of comment. Like, yeah. oh yeah, I mean, it's, he was wasting her time, but. Yeah, it's it's better that she told him and was upfront than to. I, I no, I don't want to be cheated on. No, I don't. Like, right, I'd rather not that. <laughs> you know, like, no. I mean, in that specific situation, cheat on me. I don't care. Yeah, 
And that's what? no, no, no. no, no. <laughs> that's the situation. Right? When y'all talk about inter- uh, what, just, uh, just the LGBT stuff, whatever. Uh-huh. Like, yo, you be having some wild takes. Yo, <laughs> so you with me, bro? Yeah, it's all. Yeah, it's, it's all, all in the no, category. It's all in that category, man. It's and all allies, category. Don't, allies are not part of the community. You know? like, I just heard that. I was like, come on, bro. And then my man was talking about. Uh, uh, you know, talking about eating ass or whatever is that? Get, that's a little. That's adjacent. That's, that's <laughs> right. adjacent. No, no, it's not. It's, it's adjacent. Like, that's an adjacent. It's that again. Adjacent. No, it's not. You know, it is. God. It is like like I, I, I you, have you ever seen like the dirty uh, street confessions, whatever. Like, yeah. This, uh-huh. Yeah. So so it, it was this one girl talking about she was doing all this, whatever, and then um. He asked her how, how she eats, and she was like, "Well, how, what position do you get in when you eat your uh, get your ass at? He was like, "Diaper change, whatever." Like, oh, <laughs> but like, <laughs> but I'm just saying, like, what position are you like? I don't know, bro. I don't know. I never she got my ass. I never got my ass. See, but you was you was so like, caping like, for it. I, I mean, I, I mean, I caped for it. I never, I, I never got it. I never, I never got it. 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 I never got like, it's, it's all, pegging is not gay. No, it's not. You're wild. <laughs> You're wild. It's not. It's not. Yeah, it's it's not. not. It's not. Hold on. It's, it's a it's a phallus. Yeah, I mean, it's it's something that's shaped as what we got going into you, bro. It's not gay, bro. I it's... would never get pegged though. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put that out there. Now. <laughs> I, I, would, I would never get pegged. I would never get pegged. I'm judging you. No, because no, because but it is gay adjacent. No, like it's not. Because already know it is already like. Is this is all that it's line? Not, <laughs> it's, 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 it's a man or woman consensually having sex. That's like it's like it's like all right. So all right. So you mean to tell me? So you mean to tell me if if a guy wants his G spot like touch? I think that's a bit, bro. I think that's a bit. I mean, I, 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 I wouldn't know. I'm not. All right. So all right. So, all right. So that's that's all right. So. All right, so, all right, so <laughs> They right. trying to get niggas. That, that's, the, that's the emasculation of men. Yeah, I mean, man, all right. So, let's say, so, right, so let's say it's, it's not a man. But let's say a guy wants his G spot touch. He has to go to a man. It what? Mm-hmm. So, all right. So. <laughs> Come again? No, no. All right. So, all right. So, so, so let's say a guy wants his G spot touch, but he's not gay. So he asks his his a girl to put on the strap and. Do and do what she do, bro. What? Like yeah, that's that, what that is, yes, that is good. No, it's not. It's that a woman is. doing that. It doesn't matter. Well, it's a woman doing that. Like he's like, all right, like, he wants to be satisfied in that way. Nah, nah. Why? Like, cause the thing is, you wouldn't even know you want to be satisfied that way unless, like, you was curious about. You know what I'm that's saying? That I kind mean, of activity. Like, I mean, I wouldn't. Like, like it's like at the same time, like yes, it's done by a woman. Yeah. So by definition, in technicalities, kind of no. So it is it's not gay. You period. born that no. line, my it boy. Not nah. It's not gay. You're born that line. No, it's not gay. No, it's that's a, what I'm saying. Like, it's right, a so, real thing. All right, so, all right, so, it's all right, born that. All right, so a guy that's into that can't be satisfied sexually then if he's straight? I guess. Why? Why are you even like? I don't, I don't know. know what I'm saying. You wouldn't even know to be into that. Like you, we only know one way. You know what I mean? To to do what we do. You know what I'm saying? And, and it, it ain't that way, bro. Like, <laughs> I, mean, I, mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, that's what he into. I'm not. I'm not. Yeah. I, I'm not going to judge him at all. all right. hey, <laughs> like I said, no judgment. Not saying how you live, but. Um, Niggas on that line, bro. I don't know how else you try to word it, <laughs> put it. You on that line, my nigga. But no. it's, it's simple as that. It just it for a motherfucker that do that, just accept that. Yeah. It's okay. It's, but they not gay though. That's the thing. They're gonna keep challenging that. Like, like y'all keep saying he's gay, but he's not. I'm not gonna necessarily call him I, gay. But I think I, I think that's for the women, like the majority of women, to judge. Then, like I mean, because yeah. they like how many women would be down with you know yeah, doing that yeah. and all that. And like if that's they say true. they say that's a little funny, then I think that's that's how we should move. Then, like that's funny. That's funny. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, some women are into that though. Uh-huh. Yeah, but most. But what about the vast majority? Yeah, but like that. But like that's my theory. Like oh, why people think it's gay because like, they know a lot of women. Aren't going to be in the door. Okay, okay. So that's why people think it's gay. But why, uh, and, and but my, why and do you theory. think a woman won't be in the door of that? I don't. She might think it's gay for a guy to get. She might think. 
That's how that's <laughs> how, but it's not <laughs> gay. Judge, but right? it's the not gay. Judge but it's not gay. But anyway, <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You good? 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 But no, nah, uh, no. Nah, in, in that specific in that specific situation, she don't be. Cause like, cause now in my mind, I'm thinking something's up. Cause like, out of the blue, you, that that nigga cute, so we're done. Nah, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's, it's, it's like he's saying he. I think he's saying something more to it. You yeah. Know what you, mean? Ain't, you ain't just bold enough to tell me yeah. some nigga cute unless he already, you know. Yeah. And that's like my thing is if, bro, she come to you in any kind of way, like yo, another man I'm interested in, mm-hmm. I'm good off you. What more really needs to be said? I mean, honestly. I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean yeah, yeah. For me, I'm. Yo, thank you for telling me. Don't let me find out because I most likely will find out <laughs> if you cheat or whatever the case may be. Because yeah. now I'm actually heartbroken and whatnot. I could process it better. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Like, oh, all right, she but, fucked with buddy. All right, cool. I just got to swallow that pill. It is but, what it is. But to find out, I'm thinking she's actually faithful to me. Yeah. And she went out there and did some unfaithful shit, then then I just find out. Yeah. Fuck no. I, I go know. crazy. That's, <laughs> I don't know, but that's like but that's like if the like the Sixers traded Joel and B to Nigga, this ain't bad. Hold on, hold on, wait, hold on, wait, hold on, wait, hold on. Hold on. My, my love. Hold on, hold on. 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 Hold on, to like OKC for their top two pick and we draft the Chet Holmgren because <laughs> because oh I want to see where Chet goes. We already know what Joel and B can do. Mm-hmm. So why so 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 why are you now all of a sudden trying to get somebody new that you know nothing about? All you see is potential. And even that's even deeper because she just said he cute. So I just want to see where it goes. But that's I, I, that's what I was saying in the beginning though. That I think that speaks to the state of their relationship though, man. Because ain't no woman yeah. if, if you handling what you got to handle, man. Ain't no woman about to just, just be bold enough out. and yeah. tell you that. You know what I'm saying? So like I don't know, like like you know, I, I, of course I want to kind of side with the guy on in this, but like nah, yeah. bro, like you wasn't like. Yeah, like ain't no woman coming up to me telling me that. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. oh, yo, boy, like, like, like nah, you ain't telling me about the next man. Like, nah, you're not doing that. Like, I mean, so, yes. but I don't. Nah, I don't. I would. I, I would take that though over the cheating. Nah, though, like, she yeah, don't. Yeah. yeah. No, nah, cause now, nah, cause now, nah, cause like, cause like you said, I feel like in my in my head, I feel like damn, what did, what was I doing? So you. Feel, or, so I, I let me help me understand though. So basically, you feel like if she was to cheat on you. It already gave you the validation, but if she was to just tell you that, and your mind is like an imagination attack, basically, kind of thing. yeah, because like she's just telling me, oh, oh, well, I, I just want to see where it goes. My so in my head, I'm like, damn, is she lying to me, or or like, damn, like what am I doing in this relationship? Like mm-hmm. that's why I think it's a little deeper. I think either he was caught doing something, or he, well, she found out he was doing something on the right. side, right. or she was doing something on the side, and somebody ain't told the truth. That's why. That's how I look at it. I don't know. I guess in my mind, like, if a girl comes to me and say some shit like that, in my mind, I'm already thinking she cheating. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. yeah. But, like, for her actually being woman enough and coming up to me and telling me, is like, I take that over, like, just, like, finding out. I mean, shit like I mean, that. I respect the, the her keeping it up. Like, keeping it a buck or whatever, but at the same time, it's like, damn. So, we're, we're, right, and this is kind of like something on my podcast we talked about a couple weeks ago. Mm-hmm. Um, I was talking with Marijani and she was saying how like men men take women back all the time after they cheat and I'm like hell no Listen, like how y'all feel I mean like, I mean, you ever I mean, take I told, woman back I was I was telling I was telling leak this shit it's easy for us on the outside looking in like oh that's a dumb nigga right there take taking somebody back that cheated but we don't know how he feels about her. Right, I like. I feel like love is a. But I think that 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 yeah. But logic right. kind of has to kick in. Like I kind of feel like essentially, that's like I don't even want to say it because it's bad. But like I feel like us as humans, we we're gonna make a mistake. Yeah, yeah. Not saying it's okay no, yeah, to yeah, make the yeah, mistake, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> but sometimes things do just happen. Yeah. So, I mean, like you said, it depends on really how that other person feels. They they might yeah. take them back that one time. Now, I feel like if Shorty's like a perpetual cheater, like she's just out here 
letting anybody sling and bing, and you just keep taking shorty back now. Like, I mean, that's just out of pocket. Like I said, nigga. Like I said, it's easy for us on the outside looking in to be like, oh, that's nah, a bro, stupid ass nigga. No, I mean, it, I mean, go, I mean, yeah, it's easy for us to say that. Like, that's a dumb nigga right there. Yeah, Watch it. What is it? Yeah, you kick. Well, they, was, they were saying, like, I, I had seen some comments on, on that post that I put out, and uh, some dude was like, well, yeah, if, if both people, like, if you got, like, a lot of money or if you got a lot to lose, and it's almost like you might have to take that on the chin that your girl cheating on you because, like, she, you know, you'd be divorced. And, and, like, and, and if it's your bill. wife, you know what I mean? Like, I pay that bill. You know, but um, but if you, if you bro, you know, if y'all ain't got no money, y'all ain't got no assets together, then, yeah, like, save your peace, king, and, like, leave her, bro. Like, yeah. I mean, so. I mean, I ain't gonna lie. Even with the assets, bro, like, I feel like, I don't know, man, like. Like, yeah, like, you, you spend my money already. on the next like, game, You feel me? So, like, nah, yeah, like, you yeah. are, you just take whatever lump sum it is, and I just make whatever <laughs> had to happen. That's kind of how, like, if we're done, like, we're, I'm dead. Yeah. Financially, we're cutting ties. <laughs> yeah, 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 like, yeah, 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 you're speaking from the outside looking at it's like you're telling me. I'm really you, not, though. I'm mean, not, like, I'm not, I'm not saying, I, 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 I agree couldn't, with you. I couldn't take it. I, I mean, I mean, I agree with y'all, but, like, Bro, I don't I know, like, like, if I really love somebody. My ego is crazy, ain't nobody. bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Yeah, like, you, you let a nigga, you, like, you bust it wide nigga. open for another. Like, and, yeah, I, yeah. and I gotta sit here and say, you still my wife? Like, yeah, like, yeah. my and ego and is like, like, You know, you ask her, like, did you suck, did you suck the thing? And she be like, ain't that a part of sex? And you be like, <laughs> Yeah, fucking no. hard like that. No, hard. I ain't gonna lie. I'm sorry. I ain't got time for that, man. I think that long. Even if I lose everything, I'll give a fuck. We like, 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 like it's like I can't. And the Ferrari cool, but the Hyundai is still taking to the same yeah. spot. Yeah, no, I know. That's real, that's real shit, real shit. But like, I can say I can give somebody all the advice. All I want, oh, leave him, leave her, whatever. They keep going back. They keep going back. My thing is, if logic kicks in, if logic already kicked in to you, like, yo, this motherfucker ain't treating me right, and you're still in that, that's just insanity. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah. So if you logic can say that already you kicked in, I'm sorry. You can if you stay. You can, whatever happens, that's kind of on oh, you. Yeah, in my of course, opinion. of course. Yeah. But you can say that all you want. They don't listen. They don't listen. I mean, that's a oh, fact. Yeah. Everybody yeah, gonna live their down. own life and go through their own journey. That's just how that go. But <laughs> out for the people, like if you're in a situation and logic literally already kicked in, like yo, this motherfucker ain't shit. We, I don't like him. He don't like me. She, he, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Reevaluate your shit. Yeah, yeah. Cause your peace is over. Whatever you even about to think about next. Cause if you ain't straight, whatever's next ain't gonna be straight. Yeah, thanks. So yeah, that's simple. Thanks. Yeah, like I respect. Like I'm logical. Yeah. Yeah, me, too, me too. <laughs> me too. Me too. I even told you I'm trying to not trying to stop being logical, but like trying to. You gotta open up sometimes. Yeah, yeah, I ain't mad. You gotta know when to do it. Yeah, learn that from my past. But (laughs) (laughs) you sound hurt when you said that. (laughs) It's a little, it's a soft spot. We talked about that on the previous episode. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. (laughs) but no. But yeah, like yeah, if I'm ever in that situation, back to the topic. This mm-hmm. cheat on me, I ain't go. <laughs> nah, just, nah, just, nah, just, nah, at least I know. Oh, I, I, but yeah, she. T- well, I guess she's trying to leave you. I, mean, I guess. It, I guess it's nah. At nah, least I, I'm gonna let her cut her losses, and cause yeah, either way, we gonna either way, it's gonna end to the end of the late the relationship. Yeah, I mean, yeah. If, she, if she cheated on me, and my or if she's telling me like ah, I want to move on, so like nah, I'm just nah, yeah. I'll take that. I'll yeah, take that L. Yeah, because like, at least I take that to the chin, bro. Yeah, because at least when she cheats, I I have a reason. Like, nigga, that's my a friend. reason. I like a concrete. She came to you as a woman. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, she did. Yeah. He's cuter than whatever, and I want to see what that's like. That's cool. <laughs> that's damn near cheating already, my nigga. Like, I, that's valid enough. Okay, yeah. If you go to the family first, they say, "Hey, what happened with so and so?" And you say that, they go, they gonna be like, "Oh yeah." So um last topic moving on. So uh if you as y'all heard, uh Celtics head coach 
Fuck Celtics, by the way. <laughs> but um, <laughs> I'm just gonna put that out there. But um, Ime Udoka was suspended for a year, a season, a season, and they don't know if they're gonna uh, bring him back for the seasons after for <laughs> having relations with a member of the coaching staff. Keep in mind, this man is he married to Nia Long or engaged? No, they're yeah, they're not married. Well, he's but in a relationship. They, they have, they do have a kid. Ain't that their kid, the ten year old? Oh, I think it said they share a child together. Either so, say yeah. the least. It's, a, it's, a, it's developing. Yeah. This story is yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. To say the least, he's in a relationship with Nia Long. Yeah, shout out to Nia Long. Shout out to Nia Long. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> but anyway, Eric, come on, bro. Nia Long. I like Nia Long, but yeah, we can go ahead. Like, oh, I'm yeah, letting yeah. flesh out the topic. But so, I got some shit to say. <laughs> I, Damn. I mean, you, you do want to go first? Well, <laughs> yeah, all right, yeah. So, all right, this, go, go this, what I, this is what I say, man. So, like, it's a lot of it's a lot of pick me niggas, man, on the internet, man. So, like, all right, uh-huh. I'm not the type to I'm not gonna judge the next man for for his decisions and what he yeah. what he decided to do. But like, when niggas be like, oh, yo, he cheated on Nia Long, whatever. I'm like, yo, first of all, y'all niggas don't even know Nia Long. Like, you yeah. know what I mean? Like, y'all don't know what she like, for right. real, for real. She's yeah. fine. Yeah. Yeah. And like, we all would, you know what I mean? Do what we do, yeah. whatever. Mm-hmm. But like, we, we, we ain't dealing with her or whatever. Yeah. But then it's like it's like, bro, they ain't gonna get you the pussy by by, <laughs> by saying <laughs> by saying, uh, oh, yo, I would never cheat. On, like, why would you cheat on her with yeah, her? Right, right. Like, and it's just, I, I just think that's weird. Like, like when I expect women to do that, like, like, oh, he shouldn't have did that. He shouldn't have did that. But when men be like, oh, no, nah, bro, you know, why you cheating on me? That's like, bro, mind you, like, bro, that's yo, bad bitches get cheated on every day. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know I mean? your buddy said, "Wait, what he say? He said, bro, every bad bitch is a nigga that's tired of fucking." You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? Like, you know, and, and for him, if he got me alone, that shit might like on some shit. It might be regular for him. Like, like I mean, not been it. And, and so, but this story, it is crazy because the only thing I would say is we could judge him for like, yo, bro. You mess, you fucking up your your career, like you know what I mean. You, like you risking it all for your career. Like f- forget her for a second. You know what I mean? Like bro, you the head coach of the Boston Celtics, and like it's getting out that like who who you was messing with, you what you really wasn't supposed to mess with. You know what I mean? It's one of your coworkers' people. You know what I mean? I why? Lie, that's, that's, that's my question though, because like I I kind of feel a little different. My thing is why the NBA you be getting involved? Oh, because like because it was a cover up. Cause it was a cover up. Yes. So the Boston Celtics. Like, what business is that? The grown folks. Wait, no, nah, cause I heard some more shit developing. Yeah, he her, he was harassing her apparently. Yeah. Like, uh, man, like yeah, it's, it gets it, it's allegedly. I mean, he allegedly. was allegedly he was harassing her. But like, no, nah, the Boston Celtics knew about this for months. The NBA didn't know whatever. Neil Long didn't even know until like somewhat recently, whatever that you know. What I mean, so like he he was getting in trouble and he knew he was getting in trouble. But he was hiding that shit, like from from his, everybody. Yeah, for everybody. Yeah, and and so was the Boston Celtics. And like, I get it. Like, you know, what I mean, it, he just messing around with somebody. But like, that's a that's a workplace thing too. Like, you know, yeah. if you are higher up, you ain't really supposed to mess with people that are on a different level. And then I think it's personal with the Boston Celtics because yeah, he was apparently the the one lady that they kept kept putting out there, the light skinned woman. Yeah. That's not. I don't think that's not the woman that broke the camel's back. It was a white woman. It was somebody's wife, bro. That's what I heard. Like, it's somebody, like, higher than him wife or something yeah, like that. That's yeah. like so, the conspiracy yeah, yeah, theory. Yeah. Again, it's still developed. So, we don't know. But it's like, but like, why would you, all right, whether he cheated on Nia Long and how her marriage and her virtue, whatever, right. like, bro, why are you why are you risking your career for some pussy? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, you know, that's yeah, where it comes. So that's where I I'm I think that's where we should focus on yeah. over the, you know what I mean? Like, oh yeah. But it's just niggas just like I said, they I don't know. I don't think me alone gonna see all these comments, no, bro. Not, like, <laughs> <laughs> Man, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Beyonce got cheated on my nigga, so yeah. yeah. Man, shout out to Hope though. But <laughs> <laughs> shout, shout out to Hope though. Shout out to Hope though. <laughs> But I'm just, I say that to say, like, you know, Beyonce, I think she was even considered at one point, like, the sexiest woman alive and all this stuff. So, I mean, kind of like what you said, bro. Bad bitches can cheer on every day, me. It's a part of the game. (laughs) When I, all right, so when I first heard this story, like, I got the notification from, like, ESPN or something. It's that consensual. So I'm like, well, well I know you, you, ain't, you, ain't, you ain't supposed to be fucking on your coworkers or nothing like that. So I, I get it. But then it's like he might be suspended for a year. I'm like, 
what the who who was he fucking that like, to warrant him to suspend for a year? Like, yeah, yeah, like, yeah, like, yeah. like, like, I, like, it's. I mean, I get the rule, but at the same time, it's it's that deep. And then, um, yeah, that's a, I, don't know. I saw a video of like Matt Barnes. He said that he posted a video like the day it happened in Emmy's favor, and then he said he, he took it down because he got some more information. So I'm just like, oh, it might have been a little deeper than that. Because I'm just like, a, a year suspension for getting, getting some ass? Like, this is like this yeah. is what we doing yeah. now? Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. like I mean, I'm grown for at the end of the day now. Harassment, yeah. allegedly. allegedly. Yeah. But when you just start talking that harassment and all that type stuff, then nah, that's, it's warranted. But yeah, yeah just because he fucks your wife, or allegedly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But, like, or, what, or whatever the big case might be, that's it's kind of out of pocket. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, cause yeah, like the, the year long suspension, I'm like, this a year, like, like this, not even a couple this, weeks. This, like, yeah, like, <laughs> like, why wasn't it kept in house? Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, that's why, like, that's why I, I was kind of like, it got to be deeper than this when I first when I first heard it. Yeah, because yeah. it should have been kept in house <laughs> if it was just that. But yeah. allegedly, it's more apparently. Mm-hmm. So hopefully, yeah, it's not. It's, I hope it's not either. He's still he's still gonna be suspended for the year though. That's the thing. Are they still banned? No, probably not. Yeah, probably. Yeah, you know, probably. he's suspended. You know, sometimes when he's suspended, yeah, like, they still like, pay like, you though, yeah, like cops and stuff like that. With it. That's why yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, this whole, uh, I don't know. It's crazy. <laughs> it's, it's crazy. Well, I think, and then people, I think people point out too, like they looking at the coverage of this. And and then you know you hear about Brett Favre yeah. and like why why are people mm-hmm. talk why ain't, I guess specifically sports media because it that Brett Favre story is out there like on yeah. the regular news outlets oh yeah but like they like why why ain't the other sports media outlets like covering the, the Brett Favre stuff as the same and I I think there is a difference because you got an active coach versus a guy that been retired for fifteen years yeah. even though what he did is worse you know what I mean yeah. like he's stealing like government money type stuff yeah. mm-hmm. to for for frivolous things you know what i'm saying yeah but so, uh, so wait, can i ask yeah. you so like do you like of course you blame him but like at the end of the day he just asked he didn't like put a gun to his head you know what i mean like yeah for me it's like yeah he's an asshole for asking or trying to do a favor but at the same time like Yo, people had to sign off on that shit, though. <laughs> like, oh, you talking about Brett Favre? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. That's, I think with that situation, that's more or less my thing. Like, when y'all sign off on that shit when, like, y'all ain't got clean water, yeah. y'all welfare is, like, yeah. apparently the lowest. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, yeah. you are 50 out of the 50s. Names. Yeah. That's crazier to me yeah, than yeah. him, like, "Quote unquote," asking for that favor, not in favor of Brett Favre at all, but yeah, the government made that shit happen. Their local government made that yeah. happen, though. Yeah. Like that's the shady part to me. So if they're making that happen for a, a celebrity friend, what are they doing for themselves? Yeah, yeah. I think that's really the question. Oh, that's yeah. really my question. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to go there, but yeah. I want to go there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There's a yeah. whole lot of that. It's a lot of people's over. hands is dirty in that situation. Yeah, right? yeah it's a lot and, of hands. And Brett Favre was just the name. And he's like probably like scapegoat in some ways, but exactly. yeah, but yeah, crazy. so crazy. Yeah. Yeah. He's an evil world. But even, and then people even comparing it to in the coverage of Michael Vick, and I'm like, yo, I know Mike Vick probably at home, like, yo, bro, why y'all break up? Why y'all break up? Yeah, he's like, yeah, he's a prostitute now. Like, let's be real, like, like, real with that. Uh, Mike Vick thing happened. That was like everywhere. It was. Yes. It was at like this Brett Favre thing should be everywhere. But yeah, like it's, it's really not but again though, like so again though, Mike, Mike Victor was an active player, you know what I'm saying? And you know how you know a, a certain horrible. demographic of people yeah, yeah, love their dogs. They love dogs more than people. Yeah, same kind of just take the ball, but I'm like, yeah, I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like you know what I mean, you know. But I mean so. Brett is a Hall of Famer. He is, but like, is. How, but how many people? Like, I I feel like there's people that probably don't know who the hell Brett Favre is. I mean, like, I don't this, why he's like the longest running. Nah, I mean, like, some shit, right? But he not know like Tom Brady. Yeah, like he never had that media. Nobody's like that. a Tom Brady. No, I'm talking, <laughs> no, I'm talking about like the popularity. Like, I would say more people know who Odell than Brett Favre is for real. I mean, probably like yeah, today's time, but of course, like our generation, we know who. But yeah, of course, of yeah. course, but yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's all wild. Yeah, it's all wild. But not all. So um, <laughs> this concludes uh, 
this episode. And as y'all know, when we end the show, we always give the world our final thoughts. So, Leek, what is your final thought? Take it to the world. Spread more love, not hate. Um, follow me on all socials at it's just Leek. Thank you for coming out. Definitely no doubt, appreciate man. it. I appreciate it. y'all, man. Bradley. Like and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Share it to a cousin or something. <laughs> appreciate y'all. All right. All right, so Lois, what is your final thought? Fuck the Bears! Oh, damn. <laughs> the hell? The hell? Man. I'm a Packers fan. You in the game. This Bears fan. We had to bust their ass last no, Sunday. No, no, no. You got to be no, he yeah, did not. Yeah, he yeah, did not. Yeah, 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 no, his board yeah, progress will stop, bro. His board progress will stop, bro. Got that, y'all got that ass Good. busted. Y'all had that first touchdown. Y'all thought, y'all thought shit was sweet. I mean, beating y'all with running backs as, as wide receivers. Man, get out of here, man. No, but uh, no, nah, I, 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 I don't know how you became a Bears fan, bro. Time out. Yeah. You picked your favorite NFL team based off of a punt returner. It's the greatest of all time. What are we doing here? Like a literally. punt returner, though. Like yeah, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I, mean, I, mean, I was, I was, I was like ten, and like we shared the same name. Like, oh, that's cool. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, like, he was that guy, like the person he hit a hundred on Madden. Like it was, a, it was an error. It was a he time. Was, yeah, he was nice, whatever. Yeah. But yeah, man, uh, you know, tap into my platform, man. I got two platforms: uh, two eighty plus podcasts, and then uh, recap and record podcast, man. But yeah, man. But good, good luck to the Bears. <laughs> not really, but you know, <laughs> <laughs> not really. We really not. Yeah, really. <laughs> yeah y'all got a young, y'all got a young nucleus though. I like yeah. where y'all headed though. Everybody on the team younger than me. Except for Eddie Jackson. <laughs> Eddie, Eddie Jackson and Robert Quinn. Everybody else younger than me, damn it. Right. So um that's, that's crazy. Yeah. Can't believe I can say that now. Well <laughs> <laughs> that. So um my final thought basically just uh follow our socials, uh GCC seven one seven on Twitter, the group chat chronicles on Facebook, group chat chronicles seven one seven on Instagram, TikTok. Group chat chronicles underscore seven one seven that underscore pisses me off so bad. But um, <laughs> make sure y'all like and subscribe to the YouTube, the group chat chronicles. Uh, shout out Swanee Visuals on the cam. I want to thank Los for coming yeah. out, joining us, and uh, I want to thank everybody for kicking it with us for however long we was here for. Yo, peace. peace.